Hey guys, today we are playing Super Street Racer. Don't know much about this game. Uh, I'm in career mode right now. I assume that I have to soup up my car and then make it better and challenge other people and win money by winning races with this, with this sweet ass ride over here. So far, I'm finding this okay. It's pretty fun. Whoa. Oh no, my door won't stay closed. Get out of here, guys. Uh, this guy looks like he has the same uh, shitbox that I have. That was a two for one sale, maybe. <laughs> if anyone street races out there, is, is that how it starts? Like you just start with any car and then you can enter into a street race? I mean, the, the only thing I know about street racing is what I see in the Fast and the Furious. You know, all those cars look souped up and nice. Alright, let's try to win this one and see what happens. Oh, ooh, still made it. Nice. Alright, you get XP in here. Doesn't say what level I am, though. Should be level two. Okay, what's next? Master of the handbrake. Oh, you can drift. See, now that, that car looks nice. I guess that's what I need to build up to. Oh, I was too concentrated on this blue line here. Oh. oh no, okay. Whoa, buddy. I like how the blue line encourages you to cut across lawns and cut through gas stations. Five XP. Oh, I'm level three now. Is that what that meant? Oh no, I th was in third place. Okay. Another circuit. So it looks like uh, you go in races and time trial, race time trial to build up my car. I don't want to bore you guys with that too much. Let's go for a quick race. Huh? There's a lot of tracks in here. Yeah, it looks like when you're not in career mode, you can use any car, which is kind of nice. Wish there was a list. Okay, let's just pick this one. Whatever, whatever it comes out looking to be.
Oh, this is way better. Oh, we're on the highway. Or the freeway, some of you may call it. Oh. So I play a lot of kart racers, not so much these uh, realistic driving games, but there was one that I did play a lot of and loved called, oh, did I really? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, so the one I played a lot of and loved was called uh, Split Second, Split Second Velocity. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think Disney had a hand in that one, that one was very cool. But yeah, I never played like those those Forzas or kind of those super realistic racing games. Woo. As you may be able to tell. Okay, let's concentrate a bit more. Yeah, any any game where there's this blue track line, I feel like it's too serious. <laughs> it's like a serious driving game. I just want to go where I go, man. I don't I don't need your guidance because <laughs> I find myself focusing on it too much, I'm trying to stay on the blue line, which not totally necessary. Okay, so far I think this thing is default to medium, it seems kind of easy based on my known skill level. I know I'm, I'm terrible at these kind of games, so shouldn't shouldn't be coming in first. Also, the condition of my car is always garbage when I cross the line, so there's no way I should be first in these on medium. Could turn it up a bit? Oh, no, I can't turn it up here. Okay, we're gonna bump it to hard on the next one. Wait, is this the same track? Oh, this is. Uh, I didn't change anything. I just changed the car. Okay, we're gonna abort. Yes. to unlock other tracks okay sure this one See where I can change the difficulty. Oh, it's still on medium. Ah, there you go. Okay, let's, let's change it to hard and see what happens. Ah, oh, now that's the restart. The game has to gather all the uh, better drivers out there, I guess. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm feeling this beat though. Damn. This beat is pretty sick. Hey. Yeah, just swerve right in front of me. 
didn't even stop to exchange insurance information. Okay, so I crashed twice right out of the gate. This will be crash number three if somehow he recovers from this. <laughs> oh, okay, and he's back. <laughs> and I'm still first, somehow. I guess I'll have to put it to hardcore mode and see what happens. So yeah, so far it has a serious feel to it, you know, with the blue line and all. But it seems very easy. Maybe it's for those those guys who want to feel like they're really good at racing games, but not really. Okay, we're gonna do one more and put it to hardcore and then see what happens. Let's just use any car. Maybe, maybe these cars are too OP. Maybe I'm supposed to be using my career car. But why would they do that? Okay, if I come in first here on hardcore, I'm gonna use my career car shit box and see what happens after settings difficulty okay let's hardcore also the menu for the difficulty should be before you start the race so you don't have to go through the loads again i find myself pretty critical the last couple of days Don't get me wrong, I mean, this game's still still pretty fun. It does have split screen, so if the AI turns out to be too easy, even on hardcore mode, you can always play against some friends. Oh, I did this track already, I think. Oh. Sorry guys, I don't have any tracks unlocked. That's what happens when you guys uh, experience the game just as much as I have. I just won't have anything unlocked. Oh. But that is the goal of my videos, just to give you guys a quick look to see if it's something you want to get for yourselves. Okay, so it looks like even on hardcore mode, it's it's too easy. There's no way. I mean, you guys see me crashing all over the place. The car looks like shit. <laughs> shouldn't shouldn't finish first like this. There's no way. Alright, here's the final test. We're going to use our career car in hardcore mode. See what happens. Let's change the... Uh, which one didn't I do then? I thought I did this one first. How many of that was different? Can't tell. Now the time trials seem harder than the races, but it's always more fun to race against cars. I guess we have to do this one. All right, career stock car, hardcore mode. <laughs> Let's see what happens. 
I mean, if, if I'm able to win this, which actually doesn't look like I will be able to because this car seems very slow compared to these guys. Uh, I would strictly advise that you can only play this in career mode or with friends. Or the game is just too ridiculously easy. I mean, even if I don't, if, I mean, if I don't finish last in this car, I would still recommend the same. There's just no way that, you know, based on my skills in racing games with the shittiest car here, I should be able to come first in the hardest difficulty setting. It doesn't make sense. What? Oh no. <laughs> okay. I got stuck there for a good like five seconds. And now third. This is not too terrible. I mean these AIs look like they all drive like I do. They're smashing around all the time. So now I'm wondering, who, who is this game for? Is it like for kids? I mean, how easy is the easy really? Like, was I actually lapping people? I don't know. Anyways, guys, gonna call it there. So um, in conclusion, yeah, fun game. I like the mechanics, I like how there's a handbrake, you can drift a little bit, I did that there at the end, crash into a pole though, because like I said, I'm not really good at racing games, but somehow, even in hardcore, hardcore mode, I'm able to, you know, make the podium in the shitty stock car, so I, I don't really get it, I don't really get the difficulty settings in this game. But uh, yeah, there you have it. So get it if you have friends or want to play career mode, because I'm sure, I'm sure you can't come first in every single race in career mode. They wouldn't do that, would they? I don't really know, but I don't really want to go through that with you guys this, this whole way. Uh, anyways, till next time, guys. Bye.